Good morning everyone and welcome back to the Two-Headed Wolf Gaming Channel as we are pushing today with what I'm thinking will be finally our episode when we throw down the Japanese Shogunate and we are bringing to power the Emperor. It's gonna take a little bit of time, we'll see how this works. But this is what our focus will be for today. At this point we've pretty much increased our central archives. I wanna take a quick look at not the urban centers or is it here? It is not here, it's the administration that I'm looking. Government administration and now we can go to standardize filing. This would push the amount of paperwork needed, it will give us a lot of bureaucracy, but it also pushes a lot the price of paper. Let's see how do we prioritize this. So we have in Kansai a standardized system, good. Then Kyushu will go here, we're going to go to the next level. Definitely want to push Chubu as well. And then what, Kanto? They already have it. And we have Tohoku. So let's see, is this enough? No, we still need to make a few more. I guess we can go through, through the entire thing there, right? Maybe I should have done, done it one by one. Let's do this. It's gonna increase the price of paper, of course. But I feel like we're gonna get some money if out of taxing and with central archives completed. Let's see what we are going to have. The use of filing cabinets in the government administration has drastically increased the effectiveness of the state bureaucracy. We can get 5% more bureaucracy for 5 years or or make 3k progress within the identification documents, which is something that we're working towards right now. 5% extra bureaucracy would not really help us, right? Yeah, it would just increase our state construction efficiency, which is not a whole lot. So let's make a bit of progress in our research. How far did we get? Well, it's just 31 months away. So good progress there, apparently it's going well. Explosive steel and glass is what we need in order to improve our market. We could go down in taxes over here. But I'd rather gather some wealth. A politician has died and this one is from the Buddhist monks, let's see. If we go here to details, who is leading it? A royalist now. He's tactful and he's diplomatic. What other diplomatic moves should we do? Now we could declare our interests down here in the south rather than here. This is a huge army, but I am guessing that at some point declared bankruptcy, okay, and economic concession. I'm guessing at some point we might just bring the Russians and maybe the Great Qin into this war and we can take some territory through that process. Like getting a, that entire population would add up a lot. I mean, we would still need to build our businesses, don't get me wrong, but still better. Am I making silk plantations? I feel like I'm constructing a few, right? We're making some dyes. 
Mm, yes, I am building a few of these buildings. Okay, there's a 20% chance that we will enact appointed bureaucrats. The Shogunate is now at 21.9 percentages. We've raised the industrial list at 17.7. We are losing some output because of the lack of dyes here. At least we're making steel, which should improve our situation in the market. The desires for clothes have gone down a little bit. And the price of steel, okay, so there's not such an imbalance in steel anymore. Low market access in Hokkaido. I think even with our intervention. Inkansai, what should I do? Promote social mobility. If I take a look at the population right now. What do we know about it? Well, it's mostly industrialists, then it's the petite bourgeoisie and finally the shogunate. There's a lot of peasants. Electricity's price has gone down, wood has gone down, and the price of fertilizers has slightly gone up. Okay, we have a 30% chance now to enact appointed bureaucrats. We're making progress. More gold has gold has been discovered in Hokkaido. I don't know if more. No, it's actually more. Cool. So the we don't we can't find any more resources right now but the fact that we found more gold will really pay off i'm curious to see what we will find in chubu i know that at some point i'm guessing rubber will be one of the things that we will find a gold rush spread the word to attract more migration in Hokkaido or mine it's all mine gold fields building fraud but sure mine it's all mine will do that a monument to the shogun for more prestige yes let's do that we need to get more prestige we're 36th in the world we're an unrecognized power I don't know how this goes because Egypt has it as far as prestige, we're not that far behind, but maybe this is the thing, right? We have a lot more population. Our standard of living is better than Egypt there, and our GDP is much higher. But it's mostly, I'm guessing, this prestige and maybe investing in military, right? Prestige getting f get that we get from military projection. That might be it as well. Price of oil has gone down. Let's take a look at here. Input goods for shortage in the Russian market. Dyes and explosives. Now if I wanted to make... We do not have dynamite just yet. We are researching it, but we don't have it yet. Where are we at? We are expanding the railway, so that is what we're working towards. The motors industry. Let's see. The industrials have started complaining about the existence of subsistence farms. Let's say they serve their own thing. And let us expand the motorway motor industries building in Chubu as well. Let's see what the price is. So for the railway transportation, it's at max price, that's 44.
Definitely making more clothes seems like a good idea. Now the balance of wood, that is depending on the construction, but we're using it a lot. Balance for wine seems to be great. Could go for that price. There's a huge desire for it. And it has a good price. So if I go here to the north, what are these? Gold Rush, Migration Attraction. Just look at this, look how the image has changed here. Yeah, there's a lot of smoke coming from this area. Let's see, with buildings. We have gold fields and then we have gold mines, I see. So that's the difference there. Now, which building was it that produced wine? With the wheat farms, we could produce wine. I think I'm going to go for that. Just for the extra... The extra cash that we could get. And I think I will even expand it a few times. We got medicine. From what I see there, let's go to technology and check it out. So we got pharmaceutics, plus one to the health system, institution investment. We can now go into, into health in the laws. And what we have here? No health system, charity hospitals, private health insurance and public hospital. Like if I bring... If I bring the priests in, or the Buddhist monks, they will be able to do a lot of those social investments. Preeminent members of the intelligentsia are outspoken. Ah, yeah, we'll throw them to the wolves, but we are losing some of these. Expensive tool, inefficient taxing. We're getting very close now to have enough taxes. Triage unlocked for first aid, for barracks, conscription center, and modern nursing. Okay. Our dye farms are being expanded, which means that we'll be making good money very soon. We're gonna make silk here as well. Taxation capacity, look at that. All of a sudden we're making so much more money. I'm just gonna go down in taxes here. And what should we research? Modern nursing would provide us with more for the production. Field hospital for the barracks and the conscription centers. Shall I start investing? I'm not gonna invest just yet. Let's do dynamite. Or steel railway cars. Unlocks tanker cars for oil rigs. Unlocks steel passenger carriages for the railway. And leads to electric railways. Isn't it better to get electricity first? I mean, would be rubber mastication. Yeah, let's leave dynamite as it is. Let's go for rubber mastication here. And see if we can find any kind of resources in our nearby colonies. Price of electricity is up. The price of manowars is up as well. Now, if I take a look at... What is it? Budget? Yeah, we're spending a lot here on construction sector, university, and government administration. Okay. So it's more than what we're getting from the businesses. I have to think of a way that in these centers we will be expanding businesses, making more money. 
and even more farms, right? If I look at the population, we have 1.68 million peasants and they all work probably in substance farms. Yeah, unused arable land is 442. I think that's where I'm losing a lot. Gold discovered in Victoria, Russian market, prices for tools have gone up quite drastically. For the gold mines. Going for atmospheric engines would increase our minting. Even more if I go for condensed pumps. Sure, we'll do that. Still no progress, no big progress up here in the appointing bureaucrats. Let's take a look. The Shogunate is still going down, in a sense. And we are 85 years of age. We must be living large, if that is the case. What's happening around the world? Well, Russia is doing pretty well. Wallachia is... we in an alliance with Moldova. Okay, so they escaped the Ottoman Empire. Austria is having some tensions with the Croatians. There's a Croatian uprising, okay. France is... It has expanded quite a bit of its territory. And this has spread out even Communist New Africa and Dixie Uprising. It's crazy what's happening here. I wonder if the US will ever be able to get back some of its power. Okay, I'm happy the price of opium has gone up because we don't want our people to consume it a lot. Once again, we've lost some of the power here. from low enactment stalled. <sighs> Sometimes it just doesn't want to go your way. Who is supporting this? The Intelligentsia. Let's go. And let's bolster their presence. An earthquake has hit the city-state of Kantu. Okay, 10 devastation or 25, yeah, let's put some money behind it and let's make sure that we don't, don't get a lot of devastation here. Now things will improve quite quickly. We're expanding our motors industry. Let's see, what is our need for motors? Yeah, we're very close to fulfilling the entire need for it. And that is good. We're expanding also on the farms and we have nothing else to build. So now it's time to plan the future. If we take a look at the market and we look at its details, let's see, the balance for goods. Need more clothes, need more wood, we need furniture, more transportation could be useful, and more wine, wine we are making now. 
A luxury furniture seems to catch on a good price. Okay, so let's take a look by price. Dynamite would be the best. We have a need for coffee. Electricity we can't produce. So coffee, let's make this. Let's make coffee, let's make sugar and manowars. Coffee, sugar and manowars and silk. So we'll take a look at, first of all, coffee let's go to level 5 let's maximize this sugar we will get from for example banana plantations or rice farms right I think this one produce also sugar yes it does so we're gonna increase everywhere good and what else like the price of meat could be interesting as well. So let's increase some. Um, we'll do this in Hokkaido. We'll also do in Chubu. Now with the other ones, I think I just want to go and make sure that we're getting a bit more coal. Let's take a look at what the prices are for. Coal, we have surplus right now, so the price is going down. There's no point in doing that. There is a slight desire for steel. There's a surplus of sulfur. What about lead? We have, we have a need for iron, but it's not a huge one. There's a desire for lead, so we'll be increasing these mines then. We'll do two of them there. For whaling, there's not a huge desire. More shipyards could be useful. Let's do them. Let's make some shipyards in Kansai. Maybe two levels we'll do there. I can continue with these mills, but we'll see them in the production building. Government, administration and all that. Maybe make some ports. I mean, we have a lot of areas here that could be good for ports and we're not using any. I think this is a good idea. Let's make at least one port everywhere. Improving the railways. There's a lot of money to be had by expanding everywhere. But we'll leave it as it is. And there was one more, the naval port here. Let's make a few more levels of the naval port. Try to expand that navy that we have. And finally, we will just take another look at our industry in the clothes here. And we'll say... There's many of you who produce luxury clothes. Wouldn't it be better to produce normal clothes? Apparently not. Okay. So the new ones that we've constructed have not really gone the, in the direction that I thought they would be going. And thus we will take this one which is producing non-luxury clothes and we're gonna bring it up, let's bring it up to 10. I feel like it's going to help a lot. And there we go. For right now, we're just gonna wait. We'll see if we can manage to successfully go for appointed bureaucrats. Fingers closed that that is going to happen. 
if I go back to the local police force, apparently there is more support now. There is a good chance that we can go for dedicated dedicated police force. Okay, our cash reserves are going in, in an interesting direction. I mean, we're not making a lot of profit. The price of coffee has gone down, the price of hardwood has gone up slightly. What do we have here? Standard of living. So our standard of living, especially in Hokkaido, is great because of the gold mines. We have 29.6 literacy. Radicalism has gone down. Come on, give me something good here. Give me some success. Okay. Okay. We will intervene. Yes, give us a good chance. I want appointed bureaucrats. I want that extra taxation level. Can I could somehow protect myself against opium? I wonder. The leader of the trade unionists has passed away. That is fine. We gain a bit more. No, we lost some authority. Because we lost some approval rating from the Buddhist monks. Manowar still catch a good price. Opium is even more expensive, which is good. Now let's see, diplomacy, can I... There's improved relations over here, he's trying to improve relations with the Qing and the Russian Empire and they have some good relations there. They have a rivalry, let's see, can we do the same? Yeah, we will decle declare rivalry here. And let me take a look at the and one more time at the diplomatic lands and declare interest. So we have some interests here. Now there are a lot of populations, 14 million people here would love to take this territory. Conquer state, what would that mean? So if I wanted to go to Jinan. It would mean that the Japanese shogunate would conquer this territory from the kingdom. It would give us a lot of infamy. Because we're an unrecognized regional power. And would reduce our relation with Russia, the Great Qing, France, Great Britain and the Heavenly Kingdom by doing this. And at the start of the play we would face this enemy, but what we are hoping for... Is that they will try to join us. So, they are protective to what? To us? Yes, so they are protective of us. They are cautious of us. He is genial towards us, so he likes us. And Great Britain is cautious as well. I mean, I would love to escalate it there if we can get some intervention. But let's see if this war finishes before that happens, right? This is just a step forward to getting to that point. We'll probably have to try to improve our armies overall, modernize them. Yeah, we're still spending a lot of money. Raising concerns. Sure, we'll do that. 
Come on, bureaucracy. Give me something good. Let's see if I can improve this. We cannot form an alliance. Or defensive, okay. And defensive pact and customs, nope. Take on depth. Form alliance. We're very close to that, but not there yet. Okay. So this war right here. It doesn't seem like it goes the UK's way, but they can't... The other powers can't really go into the waters of Great Britain either, I believe. It's a very risky move if they even try to do that. Okay. Now, government, if I remove you... Okay, now we would be... Our legitimacy would be at 14%. At 14% and rising, probably. Rubber mastication has been completed. Increase our radicals by 29.3, which would still remove the radicals. Let's try to do this. So all of a sudden our legitimacy at 14%, which is low. But we shall see what this does, if this is going to help us or hinder us. Nationalism is going up. More construction, more minting. I guess we can open electricity. Or something else. Let's do rotary valve engine. We're getting dynamite soon, but if we're going with rotary valve engine, then our steel mills and our workshops will be able to produce more. We can now get honorable restoration. So how can we do that? The Shogunate has ruled over an isolated and stagnant Japan for a century. If we wish to have a place in the rapidly modernizing world, we must restore the power to the rightful emperor. How do you do that? Well, the Shogunates are not powerful. Okay, we are very close here. We just have to make sure that the sh Shoguns... The Shogunate will not be powerful. So the only thing that needs to happen here is that they will need to be removed from power. We need some successful laws. I think just one more successful law is going to improve this situation here, right? The Intelligentsia group will be growing by itself. A new political movement to enact landing, landed voting has formed. And this is by the trade unionists. Support for it is low. Hereditary bureaucrats. There's a medium support for this. Communist Finland begins conscriptions. It's mobilizing the, their generals. Really, what is this? So they want, Communist Finland wants to break away from Russia. Now we're gonna settle on the side of the Russian, of course. Yeah, they're not really going to have any kind of advantage there. Success 28.5% 
industrial boom, our textile mills in Chubu is reporting a small production surplus in industrial goods. Very well done. A politician from the Buddhist monks have died, okay. Well, who is in its place? A pacifist. He wants no colonial affairs, okay. Now if I... can I bring anyone in? No. We need to bring in probably the... a powerful... leader, right. So let us continue here. We're building our ports now. I feel like we should go up in taxes because we're running out of cash. We have dynamite, which would also mean that we should start producing some dynamite in factories. I would think that they're probably somewhere maybe under sulfur. Yes, no, this is just what we're using. So, goods consumption would be dynamite in order to produce more sulfur. Okay. Well, who could produce dynamites? Arms industry? Nope. It's either the chemical, maybe the chemical, either the chemical plants or the munition factory. But even the munition factory, I don't think it would, right? Let's see, can I take a look? Do we have any kind of fertilizers being produced right now? Or chemical plants? We do not have chemical plants anywhere. Okay. Well, let's make some chemical plants here then. We'll make two because we want different types of production. We want one of them to be producing fertilizer most likely and the other ones to be producing dynamites okay they seem to be growing a little bit Explosive in the Russian market and glass in the Russian market has been increased. So if we take a look at urban and we look at glass works, we're using everything that we have available in order to expand here. So we should be expanding our business then. Two in Shikoku and one in every other place. In act per capita taxation, there's some support from the peasants. No real radicalism, but there's support for that. And I would agree. I mean, at this point, if I go to laws and I look at land-based taxation and I would go for per capita taxation, 49% chance to enact it. And we would receive, what, 25.6 per month? That's a huge difference there. This war is stalling. We have a new event, 
The most prominent members of the Kansai High Society have been organizing luxurious party in the new and lavish urban buildings. More of these threats become loyalists, or the party will never end, plus free to the minimum expected standard of living for the upper strata, but 25% of them become loyalists. Now let's just celebrate. I don't need you to need stuff. I just want you to be happy. It's looking quite cool. More die needed. Hmm. What are the chances? This is a 1 in 4 chance to get in appointed bureaucrats and I'm hoping that we can finally do it, but you never know. A politician has died from the industrialists and who did we get instead? So in the industrialists, a pacifist. Okay, well, the good thing is, at least now we will be able to remove our colonial affairs. I think I want to stop bolstering the Intelligentsia. Engines have become slightly more expensive. Now if I wanted to, could I start expanding the railways to, this to these places? I could. Could make some money out of it apparently. Yeah, I think at this point we are running out of a balance, we need to expand transportation even further. Of course we could go this way. And get a lot of money from it. So now that we've made what we wanted here and there. Let's give to the most... Actually, let's increase the level everywhere. And afterwards, I'm even going to supply more to the motors industry. Good. Now, if I take a look at the motors industry, because I just saw it earlier, Going for a different method would require less machinists and laborers, but I don't think we need it right now, right? We have enough people to bring forward, revoke British claims, and crush West Indian secession. A peace treaty has been signed. Okay. Yeah, it's not really going well here. Radical Sweden. The industrialists have started complaining. Eh, you know what? Just leave. Let it go. Okay, 37.7%. At least we're making progress here. Low market access. Turmoil from radical pops. Apparently, there's some turmoil in Tonga. But why don't we have enough? It's not a, because we're using. Our infrastructure is good, so... Maybe it's the amount of goods that we have? Is there such... Well, what happened to the prices here? What's with this increase?
I don't know, but it seems like people want quite a lot of stuff. Maybe they've brought in... Let's take a look at the market. Did they bring in people? Hmm. I don't know, maybe they brought in some a new person into the market. A deadly fire has killed many workers in Shikoku due to part due in part to a dangerous working condition and locked emergency exits. It has been revealed that Michisura Togo, a preeminent member of the Shogunate, was the owner of the now scorched factory. He must be held responsible. They will lose some political strength and they will also lose some approval because we challenge their powers. Hey, it's an unfortunate event, but I'm hoping that this will start pushing them back. An admiral has died. The one who had the event. Now we have no general. If we recruit one, they're both from the Shogunate and I do want, don't want any of them. We have 14 more battalions that we could give to someone. Let's see, does that work? We, are th we have 33 right now, right? 33 people. I can say recruit a general, but once again they're from the Shogunate. Okay, we'll not bring them in, just because I don't want to give them more power. Now we keep expanding on this business. The highest price right here is the die. And because of that, apparently we are not making a lot of money. Okay. Let's see, what are we going to research going forward? A steam donkey? Improve, improve fertilizers for the extra goods? could be let's try to get some le electricity here and while we do that we can take a look at what the rotary valve brought well it needs a lot of tools and it needs a lot of coal it would just reduce the number of people apparently who could would work on it Steel mills, let's see, if I go to the next level, it would increase the coal production, but it would also increase the cash that it's bringing in. Okay, then I'm going rotary. I need a lot more coal there. Any change here? Nope, still the Shogunate. 41%. Why am I getting such a low market? Is it because we've built the ports and they're too small? Are they somehow trying to access the market here and they can't? Because I do not understand this. Market balance. We are buying more than we are selling or something. Maybe that's the thing. Right, the prices of some of these goods are high. Or maybe the, it just opened access to the world in all of these territories and we sh that shouldn't have happened. But it is a bit weird. <laughs> mm. 
due to shipping lane effectiveness. Do I need a shipping lane? This is the shipping lane. Russian shipping lanes. How many convoys are available versus required? Okay, so if I want to have better shipping lanes, does that mean that I need more ports here? Let me take a quick look here. I am just trying to figure this out, I have no idea. If we go like this, the price of clippers will go up and we'll lose some money, but it's going to provide us 3600 convoys. So let's see, if I do all that, will it provide more access to the Russian market? Apparently so. So we just needed more here, maybe we need to bring in an admiral as well. Let's see if bringing an admiral will make a difference. Yeah, current zero. Arrogant would reduce his popularity, naval commander and dockyard organizer. Or an arrogant... Yeah, maybe that's the thing that we have to do here, we just have to bring someone over to do all that. At this moment we're losing a lot of money, mostly from government wages. Not a whole lot of money we can save by doing that. Free foot flotillas in reserve, secession movement possible. A lot of turmoil in Malaysia. Okay. So the Shogun just gained a lot of support for some reason. Probably a lot of people are unhappy because of lack of market access. Okay, now we're finally to 100% again. That was really weird. Maybe it is because of the ports, right? Maybe that was the thing. Maybe until we had ports, they would transport their goods via land. But now that they have, they all have ports, we've opened up to the world. But somehow it didn't show us here in the infrastructure that maybe we're using too much or what. Yeah, that is a bit weird. It gave us a lot of turmoil from it. If I go down in wages, we would lose some of the prestige. And we would save some money. Yeah, I'm starting to go into the negatives now. And we're still not making good progress on appointing bureaucrats. Let's see. We can bring the intelligentsia to be the leading for. You know what? For now, let's do that. Now, if I do that, we just lost. Apparently, we lost legitimacy there. If I bring back the Shogunate, yeah, they would be happy. Let's see how we work with this. Okay, we're starting to gain some legitimacy from it. Okay. 
explosives in need, okay. We finished our fertilizer buildings, so I am thinking now that if I go to them, LeBlanc process, okay, so prioritize fertilizer production, or we could start making some explosives. Yeah, either way, we're gonna produce a lot of explosives. Engineers, a lot of engineers. Let's see, this will consume more coal and a bit more sulfur. And it will produce less fertilizers, but it will produce a lot more explosives. Let's do that. Let's try to take advantage of a business. Maybe we will do two. So we'll have... In here we'll do explosives. Let's do fertilizers up there. Right? So we have a different type of business in either direction. And after all that... We can see if we... Might be able to use... Yeah, we could get a lot of cash here. So, what is either coal, iron, lead or sulfur to produce more? Or directly gold. But I don't feel like going this way. Like getting more gold from it is good. Coal or iron mines. Let's see. The price of goods. Coal. We need 806. Okay. So coal it is. We're going to go here. We're going to say that I want you to use dynamite. This will bring in a lot more coal. It would raise the price of explosives, but it will also go down as we start producing more. Let's check this, right? Yeah, now that we are starting to hire people, the price of explosives should start going down. Okay, I guess we need more, so let's go up. Diplomatic place in Oceania. Okay, so the UK is going here to revoke some British claims. They, uh, they were trying to revoke British claims, okay? We're just gonna stay neutral there. Low market access once again. The power of the purse for more training, more officer. This is, yeah, recruit an admiral. Let's see. Go from the shogunate once again. Don't want to bring them more power, but I might just have to do it. We have, we're gaining a bit of diploma of legitimacy right now, and you are 91, and you do not want to die. And we're losing market access again because apparently right now it's not about the Russian shipping lanes anymore. Yeah, I, I have no idea to be honest right now what's what's what what is happening. But what I should probably think about doing is make more boats.
If I decrease taxes, we would lose a lot of money, but would this improve market access? No. So this has nothing to do with whether they can afford something or not. Okay, good to know. Tax avoidance has been deactivated. Good, so we're getting a bit more taxes back? Yeah. Apparently, some of the people are unhappy with us. More diplomatic place in the Baltics, okay. We're still stalling here with the appointment of bureaucrats. Less taxes from agriculture, ranching and plantation because the shogunate are unhappy with us. Do I just want to go forward with this one? I mean, it's so close. Yeah, we're starting to make some money. I mean, expanding the glassworks and now we'll be expanding the railways as well should bring in quite a bit of cash. The price for fine arts apparently is really good. Then what we're going to go and do is go to the Urban and be like Hey Arts Academy, haven't seen you in a while? Try to make a few more arts. Okay, the chemical plants are doing well. Dynamite is still at a high price. Are the coal mines still doing well? Yes, they're all making money. Probably could have been better in other situations, but hey, good money is good money. Buildings, development, ports. For industrial ports, we would need less clippers, which would tank the price of clippers, but we would need steamers. Max want colonial affairs. Okay, now we're once again, we have enough market access. can produce electricity. What else are we going to do now? Steel cars for oil rigs, improved fertilizers. 31 months for that. Let's do it. Okay, the industrialists have gained a lot of power, so did the intelligentsia. If I would reform the government and I wanted to bring in someone else, so Either party I am bringing in would make me lose legitimacy because they are still very powerful. They are considered the most powerful. Okay. Recruit a general over here, they're both from the Shogunate. If I want to recruit a navy officer, an admiral, go from the Shogunate. I mean, by investing a lot into... in what was part, also industry, but also in... Uh, 
farms and that, I gave them a lot of wealth. I mean, it's only the industrialists that seem to have a lot more. Actually, everybody has. What about the peasants? Even the peasants have enough money. Enact dedicated police force. Great. Arboriginal uprising wants to a defensive pact. Nope. This war is still going. The US is still broken up. Now let's see, children working in the textile mines in Chugoku have suffered injuries. The new industry needs all the employees it can get, sure we'll do that for a while. How happy are the industrialists with us? They're neutral right now. Okay. So we can get a bit of happiness, but let's ignore and reduce even further the political strength of the Shogunate. Okay. It's almost under 20. So they are not considered, or maybe they need to be a majority. Maybe we need to somehow, let's say we can go here and be like, I want the industrialists to be bolstered. I want them to continue their strength. Although I don't want to do that for a very long time. Because they'll be very annoyed when I'm starting to invest more money into certain services. Let's take a look at our budget. I am spending a lot here in our capital in Kansai. While not producing a whole lot. We need to go... Yeah, we're gonna suffer just for a bit longer. I'm hoping that this law will hit because we are going to go for per capita taxation next. It has support, it has everything it needs. If I do a dedicated police force as well, I think it's going to be good. Fine art, look at that price, 323. Impressive if I do say so myself. And we need to have the Shogun and not be powerful as a faction for 10 total years. But I feel like when they go under 20, we can even go and say that we want to suppress them, right? Insufficient authority available. Well, let's see if we can take away some of the actions that we're doing. Let's cancel this. Yeah, 400. Okay, let's do two of them. And then let's see if we can... We can start suppressing them. Beautiful. I guess we don't need to bolster the industrialists anymore. What is this? They want us to join there. Nope, I do not want to join the movement. And yeah, I will stop bolstering them for now. The Heavenly Kingdom has improved their relation with China, with China, with Russia, unfortunately. There's another battle here. There are a few battles here. Yeah, definitely need to fight a war to understand what's going on here. Because I don't truly understand it. Okay. So the Shogunate are not powerful anymore. We're starting to get the Honorable Restoration. I know I'm making this episode slightly longer, but I, I just want to complete that objective. 16.8. Volcanization has been unlocked. 
Look at this, 16.8 in power. The industrialists are now the most powerful in the country. We're gonna start the suppressing there. I mean, I'm hoping that now it's going to go our way. Preserve, bureaucrats, hereditary bureaucrats, no. The samurai also support the dedicated police force. Okay, we're getting somewhere. If we bring the shogunate in, apparently our legitimacy increases. I mean... I wouldn't mind having them around necessarily, I just do not want them <laughs> in power, but the honorable restoration means that they are not part of the government. We're trying to leave behind the shogunate. They'll probably turn into a different kind of class. Despite not enjoying the full rights, okay, what do we want to do? Discrimination? Sure. And probably him dying would also help, because the, his heir is an industrialist, and I think that will improve our legitimacy, because it will have the support of the government. Where are we at as far as engine goes? Okay, the price of engines is pretty good. Steel is decent as well. Now, if we wanted to improve some of these, we can make elastics, which we would need, we would need rubber for it, but we don't have any kind of situation where we can add to that. Let's see, paper mills, chemical plants, we already spoken about them. Motor industries, reduce the amount of workers, shipyards, reinforce wooden ships. It would tank the price of clippers, mostly because it would consume more engines and a lot more hardwood. Okay, so production would be great. Electrics, we don't have electricity yet. Public trams, can I do that now? No, not yet. Then in our businesses, can I put a railway everywhere? Electric fences. Okay. Let's see. I could start making more, use more dynamite for more goods. In our plantation, I'm not using the rail transport, but I think I should start doing it. Yeah. I mean, the, dis the need for it would definitely increase. But I feel like the transportation of goods is also impressive. More fishing trolleys. Let's do fishing trolleys all over. What's this? Revolution brewing. Cause, because they are angry. So they are angry at us. Why are they angry? Let's figure this out. Minus one from insurrectionary interest group. Minus three from power challenged. Okay, so we've done that for a while. And minus one for urban concerns ignored. We have a few pluses here and there. Should I just suppress their power? I guess they have a lot of radicals. And they keep going forward. So what can I do here? We 
the following states would succeed Chubu and Kanto. I think I have to stop this. Right? Like, if I stop this, I feel like it's going to be improving a little bit. Hmm. How do I stop a revolution? Do that. Yep. So it is unfortunate that we stopped the the law there, but I guess they were unhappy here. And now we're getting even more taxes because apparently that brought them to neutral. They really hated that law. I guess it we waited for too long. It took too long to implement. And we can start thinking about something else. Yeah, I can't do anything here for a while. If I do per capita taxation... <laughs> yeah, they would oppose once again. They would go from minus 4 to minus 9. But this might happen so much quicker. Should I make them angry again? Dedicated police force, if I do this... Once again it would reduce their power. But they would endorse this movement or this change a lot quicker and it would reduce the radicalization of it. Come on, let's make this very quick. Honorable Restoration is still going on. But I guess there's still some time away until we can finally form the Japanese Empire. So I'm just gonna put a cut in here. And we're gonna come back tomorrow. And I'm hoping that by that point we will be able to finally reach a point where we can make this happen. Hope you have enjoyed it. I thank you very much for watching. And I look forward to seeing you again tomorrow. Until then, I wish you all to have a wonderful day.